those of you who aren't aware what the ESA Fruit project is, it's a major ambitious project focusing on research uh, and development to increase the consumption of fruit and vegetables uh, in, in Europe. It's actually the largest integrated project uh, which is entirely dedicated to fruit. Consumers, they want health, they want functional foods, but they know quite a lot about functional foods. They want safety, quality, convenience, value for money. Uh, consumers expect, rightfully, to become more healthy when they eat more fruit. But do they also expect to become more healthy when they drink fruit juices, for instance, or when they eat or drink other processed fruit products? In fact, uh, we don't know uh, exactly what the health properties are of uh, processed fruit products. basic health, place and safety, we, have, we got the idea that people already know that. It's, it's, it's something that they already want instead of something new. So the new products have to be just more than just these basic characteristics of uh, fruit. We have produced new products which we call Apple Plus Plus products. So we have apple slices with prebiotic, apple slices with probiotic, we have apple slices with aquamen, which is a very highly available calcium source to humans. And we have apple slices with chocolate, and we have also apple slices with honey. Fruit has multiple health effects in, uh, in humans, including effects on cholesterol, blood pressure, healthy gut, etc. And these health effects are probably caused by different constituents. Nobody knows for sure. Uh, what makes fruit healthy, and that's uh, probably contrary to what most people think. Uh, they believe that we know already it's the antioxidants or it's something else, but we don't know. Uh, it's not true. So uh, we need uh, the research to find out and also to improve our products in such a way that we use this knowledge uh, to uh, get more healthy products out of Regarding apple, with, we uh, put segment the population in, in two very big groups. One group uh, that accounts for 68% of the people that uh, took place in the test that like it sweet, balanced varieties. The other side, 30% of the population that like acidic varieties with acidity above 7 8 grams per liter. Now, can we increase fruit consumption? That question was the main question. And with that that I show here, I think we can say yes, as long as we provide the consumer for the, the, the right variety. Mr. Fruitness for three years in this project. 